About 60% of the flavor that's in the whiskey that you drink comes from the process, comes from the grains that are used or the fermentation that takes place. About 40% of the flavor actually comes from the wood. Specifically, it's coming from the oak barrels that are used. The reason that they use oak when they're making whiskey is that oak is a very tightly grained wood, which means that when you turn it into a barrel, it's not going to leak, which is a bad thing when you've got a barrel. Oak is really porous, which means that the air, oxygen, can come in and out of the wood. It's like the whiskey is alive, breathing inside the barrel. And that's really important, particularly in Scotch whiskey, where they tend to use barrels that they've used before. You've probably heard people talk about ex bourbon or ex sherry casks. What that means is that barrel or that cask used to have bourbon in it or it used to have sherry in it. And when you add in your new spirit or your new whiskey, it takes in some of the flavor from the previous occupant. So if I have a sherry barrel, that means that I'm going to get tastes of sherry in my whiskey. And that's great. And there's a lot of biting about barrels. <laughs> whether or not bourbon is better than sherry or sherry is better than bourbon. In my opinion, it doesn't really make a difference. I mean, of course it makes a difference in the flavor, but bourbon versus sherry, one's not better or worse than the other. They're just different. And different is okay. It gives you different flavors, and that's important. And that's why the barrel or the wood that they use is so important, because it gives you a whole range of different flavors. When we went to Glengoyne, where we had a barrel of laughs, talking about the influences that sherry wood, or using sherry casks, have on their whiskey. Two thirds of all our flavor comes from the wood, and what was introduced before, and 100% of our color comes from the wood, or the drink that was in that wood before. We use red Spanish oak and white American oak. Red Spanish oak means that the redness has, contains the tannins. White, no tannins. And this wood from Spain is very porous, so it's going to allow lots of evaporation to absorb lots of colour because it's soft wood. The Spaniards cut down trees in northwest Spain, dry the wood out in the sun for three years, and then send it down to Jerez. And the wood is very porous, so it absorbs lots of the colour, but it exchanges the fruit flavours from the sherry. You've then got a dark chocolate spiciness from little crystals that form in the wood, which is anything, and it's mouth coating. That mouth coating Christmas cake, uh, the spices, the cinnamon, the nutmeg, those were all the things you'd expect to find in a sherry cask. What do you prefer? Do you like sherry? Do you like bourbon? Do you not really care? Do you just like whiskey, whatever barrel it's been in? Let us know in the comments down below. And remember to subscribe to our channel. We do a new whiskey video every Wednesday.